My name is Josh Soderlund. We are at the Soderlund's Wood Mill. Jason and I started working together in West Yellowstone, Montana. And we moved back to Minnesota four years ago and started the Soderlund's Wood Mill in its current form. And we've been working together ever since. So a lot of what we do is we're not doing traditional bucking up firewood or felling trees or limbing. A lot of what we do is pretty technical. The saw is having to rev pretty high um, and it's having to rev without a whole lot of load on it. That's hard on things because things heat up. One of the things that I do here is I, I do all the, the motor repair on all the chainsaws. And prior to actually using the Amsoil products, I worked on our chainsaws a lot more. Our chainsaws are pretty old and they have a lot of hours on them because we just have not needed to replace them. And one of the big reasons for that is number one, we do take care of them, but one of the ways we take care of them is we, we're conscious of what we put in them. And that's really important. On our smaller chainsaws, the exhaust ports are, are pretty small. And so what happens is if, with, if you're using a, a traditional or just standard two-stroke oil, there's a lot of high, it's high in carbon content, and those exhaust ports will get plugged. After we started using the Amsoil product, cut way down on exhaust smoke. I think the, one of the main proofs is that our saws have lasted so long. Some of these saws are nine, ten years old, and I use them on almost a daily basis. I've seen a lot of carvers go through saws like you know annually. Um, I prefer to just keep these ones running, they work great. Like with any art form or anything creative, the goal is to just stop thinking about what you're doing and to just engage with the process. And when you don't have tools going down constantly and you can trust your tools, you can trust um, the things that go in your tools, you can stop thinking and just start engaging with your art form.